Now, Chief Meteorologist Scott Dorval with your precision forecast. All right, let's talk a little weather. This morning we had that cold front come through. Boy, what a blustery morning it was. But now not too much going on, but more snow showers and colder weather moving in. That's the key. Here's a view from the Ford Dealers Tower Cam atop the Grove Hotel. A lot of cloud cover. Again, not too many showers. In fact, very few flurries in the Treasure Valley, but there are still snow showers occurring in the mountains. Let's take a look at Precision Live Doppler. And this shows as we sweep the skies, Boise, Caldwell, Nampa, nothing much going on. But there are some snow showers popping up uh, in the Boise Mountains. You don't get much coverage. Here around Lucky Peak, there's a snow shower here. These are fairly light to the north. They're a, bit, a little bit heavier, but generally light. The real accumulating snow came in with whiteout conditions briefly, actually from 7 to 9 o'clock this morning in the McCall area. The uh, state police reporting whiteout conditions. And as I look at the snow accumulations, anywhere from 4 to 9 inches of snow, although the top of Tamarack had a foot of snow, Brundage Mountain had about 8 inches of snow, uh, Mid Mountain and Tamarack had a foot of snow as well, only 4 inches at the base, but it we're talking 7 inches in McCall, so there was a good amount of snow all across the West Central Mountains. More snow showers continue to track in from west to east. Temperatures are blustery and chilly. It's 42 in Boise, 37 in Mountain Home, and unlike last night, when that sun goes down, these temperatures are going to drop like a rock tonight, and then the uh, snow showers will increase into the mountains and then start tracking towards the Treasure Valley as well. There's more moisture offshore and there's a disturbance here that's going to start to circle on in. A lot of the energy will go to our south, but one computer chart shows some light snow over us. At light snow is all you're going to need with temperatures below freezing. This morning when the snow came in, it was actually near 40. It rained, then turned to snow and the temperature dropped, so the roadway wasn't cold. It was tough to get ice, except east of Boise. It was pretty nasty. Tomorrow, a different story. Cold air in place and light snow showers coming in. 10 o'clock, there could be some light snow falling in anywhere you see the blue area. This again is 2 o'clock in the morning. Again, snow showers, Ada County, the northern portions of Ada County, Boise north and east. And you see here the chance of some moderate snow. This is 8 o'clock in the morning, and that's why I think. I think we have a good chance for a slick morning commute. It won't take much, just a coating of snow, and there could be an issue. But I think we could see up to a couple of inches of snow in the Boise area tomorrow. That is a possibility. Here you see Friday, the sunshine returns, but it is tomorrow morning where we have the issue. So generally three to six inches of snow falling in Idaho's mountains, four to six in Stanley, and in the Treasure Valley, I've got a trace to two where there's some updated snow numbers coming in, about four inches of snow in Long Valley, maybe four to six. I'm thinking more four inches in Long Valley. The the Treasure Valley, that's where I see. Here's my updated numbers here. Computer charts now showing two inches of snow in Boise, and you can see where the snow would be eastern sections up, of course, into the mountains. So we're going to watch this closely, but tomorrow morning could be accumulating snow as this blast of cold air moves on in. Treasure Valley forecast temperatures tomorrow only near 40 during the afternoon, but watch out for a trace to two inches of snow during the morning and then gusty winds in the afternoon. Generally two to six inches in the west central mountains of snow showers off and on. East central mountains, three to seven inches possible. While in the Magic Valley, you could get a couple of inches of snow here in a slick morning commute, likely in the Magic Valley again with temperatures in the 30s. My precision extended forecast. Winter time for one more day. Still chilly on Friday, but it dries out. And this time of year when the sun comes out, it gets nice. That's Saturday and Sunday and Monday. There's your three-day weekend. Timing's perfect. It, it is. Oh three day weekend I think that people will make. Yep. And yes. then a little down again. Yeah, and then a little down again after that. So enjoy the weekend. Okay. All right. Thanks, Scott. Next on today's